Hey guys, Matteo here. Welcome back to a new video. Today we are in Gambellara, near Vicenza, northern Italy. We're shooting basically a brand video for uh, Zonin 1821. Big winery, huge winery here in Italy and all over the world pretty much. Uh, today we're doing one day shoot actually, but we're gonna cover three brand video. We're shooting on the Pocket 6K. With the only one day shoot, I want it to be pretty flexible and uh, the Pocket is gonna give me the kind of speed that I need to capture b-roll for three different videos they are 30 seconds each but they want different shot for each video so a bit tricky a lot of stuff to shoot but we're going to start with the interview right now and then we're going to move to b-roll down in the cellar we're going to do some lifestyle some drinking some all this kind of stuff i shot already some drone footage yesterday and this morning at sunrise it's looking beautiful nicola behind the camera with the pocket 4k and nikkor on the speed booster so beautiful lenses but yeah we're shooting on the pocket 6k like our Perfetto, facciamo un cambio bicchiere così ce ne versiamo ancora uno. Cosa è zio? È troppo! Non è dentro! Tutte e tre le bottiglie pronte per andare in cantina dopo l'intervista. Poi questo qui lo tagliamo così no. Va bene, lo vuoi? Sì, mi pare sì. Era solo 16, ma è tornato con questo per espandere la famiglia di un paese molto unico. And we just finished the first part of the interview. We are out there two parts, changing a little bit the setup and the wardrobe. And then we're gonna move down to the cellar, capture a lot of B-roll. It's gonna be nice. Then we're gonna do some product shot, waiting for Francesco to come back, and then we're gonna do more more shots of him opening bottles and this kind of stuff, lifestyle stuff. Then we're gonna film some bottling. And then we're gonna move to the vineyards and do some product shot there. Also, we're gonna shoot some people having fun here, having a charcuterie, drinking some Prosecco, that kind of stuff, so. No, I think it's this. Yes, no, the sage is always good. Basta. Basta. Quando vuoi. Perfetto. Questo lo prendono, lo facciamo prima. Ah, si mette qua, voi, eh, voi due state da questa parte, okay. vi parlate, cosa avete fatto oggi, <ride> solite robe. <ride> eh. La foto. Oh. <ride> sì. Perfetto. Sì. Col brividi. Che dopo un secondo fai questo? Sì. Ma di che... Di, che è di Natale, di... <ride> La modella del... Flying some drone here in Gambellara. 
We're getting some uh, Zonin Prosecco shot right now, product shot. And after this, we're going to the vineyard, capture some shot there, and then we call it a day. But let's just roll. Sì, anche e possiamo fare possiamo fare la stessa cosa su questi anche. Ti sali, però ti ritieni sulla tua sinistra. Nel filare uno a fianco che abbiamo un sole bello che viene giù così. Ok, da lì va bene. Stessa cosa, ti seguo da vicino. We made it up to the Zill, to the vineyards. Now it's changing outfit because again, we're doing three brands video. 30 seconds, not a crazy amount of time, but you still need the product shot for all the products. You need him sipping the wine with all the products. Every product has a different outfit. So very run and gun, very uh, one man band kind of, kind of show. But I think we got some really cool stuff. I didn't see anything on the computer yet. We're approaching the end. Everybody's kind of tired. Woke up very early this morning. Nobody slept too much. So let's grab some of the last shot and then we close down this project. Another one into beautiful vineyards. Castello del Poggia has a very long history that goes back to the 16th century. Moscato is a very unique variety, very aromatic, naturally sweet. It's only five or six percent of alcohol, so it's uh, a wine you can enjoy if you're at the beach with friends or uh, alongside a pool. Moscato really opened the whole road to what we call the sweet life. You don't really need a reason to enjoy a glass of Castello del Poggio Moscato or of uh, sweet wines. You just probably need someone to enjoy it with. Castello del Poggio has been part of our family for 40 years. One of the wines I'm more proud of is Castello del Poggio Prosecco. So it comes from the largest family-owned vineyard of Prosecco in Italy. It is particularly aromatic, rich of fruit, floral, a little bit bitter, but not too much. We vinify a little bit of Prosecco every other week. The goal here is to have every consumer around the world experiencing the freshest Prosecco possible. The history of our family starts in uh, 1821. What is different about the Nim Prosecco is that we control production through our vineyards, but moreover, because of the way we produce the wine and we ferment the wine. The way I love to enjoy a glass of the Nim Prosecco is with friends, with family. It's my five minutes break where I can enjoy it for small reasons that make your day very special.